Well, hey, my name is Josh, and I'm the pastor of Thrive Church that meets in the Madeira Ranchos. And I want to give you your moment with God for the day. In John chapter 8, Jesus lays out his second I am statement. He gives us seven I am statements within the book of John. And the hope is that we, through knowing who he is, can better understand who we are. Last, uh, the last I am statement he gave was, I am the bread of life. And, and today he reveals to us that he is the light of the world. He says, I am the light of the world. Anyone who follows me will, will not walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. There's two intrinsic promises here. Jesus saying, one, if you follow me, you will not walk in darkness. Have you ever had a time in your life where you're walking in darkness? Have you noticed that you're probably not walking with Jesus when you're walking in darkness? That there's this tie between walking in darkness and walking alone. But when we follow Jesus and when we walk with him, we don't walk in darkness. Secondly, what is he saying here? You will have the light of life. What does light do? Light gives us warmth. Light helps plants to grow. Light dispels darkness. Is there darkness in your life that's overcoming your life? See, look, I just want to tell you this, that true life begins when we let the light in. Where are the places in your life that you need to let the light of life in? Maybe you can just pray right now in this moment, Jesus, let the light of life into every aspect of my life. Have a blessed day.